Hi, this is a demonstration of the Android controlled firefighting robot project. So, here you can see the robot is controlled by an 8051 family microcontroller. So, this is interfaced with a Bluetooth modem to you know that allows the user to control the uh, bot through an Android app. So, the system consists of you know DC motor for uh, driving the this arm. This arm is used to you know rotate and uh, fire you know put out the spray of water. Uh, this is connected uh, through a pipe to a, a pump motor and these uh, other two motors uh, for use for uh, running the rover are uh, controlled by uh, driver IC that is interfaced to the A05 family microcontroller. So how the, this project works is basically uh, the Bluetooth uh, uh, the Bluetooth modem is used to receive the commands that are sent by the user uh, to the Android and these commands are then transferred to the A05 microcontroller. The microcontroller processes these commands and then it uses the driver IC to drive res uh, respective motors you know to achieve the desired functionality as commanded by the user so let's see how the system works so as you can see the android app here so let's first uh, run the vehicle in forward direction let's stop it now to this button now let's move it in backward direction Let's stop it now. So let's move it in uh, left and right directions now. Let's stop it now. So, you know, even here, this is a firefighter robot. So, you know, this uh, here you can see this uh, uh, arm. The, this can be, you know, uh, move up uh, in up and uh, down directions in uh, slow movements you know to uh, control the uh, accurately control the movement of the arm so let's see how this works this is handled through ANH so this is how you know it's uh, used to manipulate the position of the spray, the direction of the spray, you know, to spray water on the particular, you know, on a particular spot accurately. So this is controlled by a DC motor that is uh, used to drive this uh, uh, spray pipe. So this is also connected to a pump motor. So whenever we, after we position the spray, uh, we can, you know, activate the pump motor. So currently we haven't filled any water for demonstration purpose, but uh, after you fill the water here, so it's puts out the spray of water as uh, with a good force so this is the motor activated the motor is located here behind the PCB so this is how Android controlled firefighting robot project works hi so this is the live demonstration of Android controlled firefighter robot 2 so let's see how the firefighting robot works in real time so we are using this Android app to control the robot. So let's move it in forward. Backward. And left right directions. So now let's position it to spray inside the plate. So now let's uh, spray. So as you can see it is filling up the plate. 
with water pump. So let's stop the motor now. Hi, so this is the second part of the Android Control Firefighter robot demonstration. So let's check its efficiency of diminishing a fire. So here we use our Android app again to control the robot. So let's go near it. Let's position it. Diminish the fire and let's put out the spray. So as you can see the fire has been you know minim uh, diminished uh, using our uh, within a matter of seconds using the firefighter robot. So this is how you no know, firefighter robot is efficient at putting out fires. Thank you.